celebrating the region's new up-and-coming services. The Transport Minister on hand to discuss the next stages of the Gippsland train line. This $530 million upgrade, which has got the track duplications, it's got the second platforms at key stations, that's designed about running, uh, gives us the capacity to run more trains. Just over the last weekend we've been doing some major work on track and signal upgrades to, uh, to give us a more reliable, smoother journey. East Gippslanders have long awaited the arrival of Velocity trains and today they were given an exclusive tour at the Bansdale station. Really happy with the amount of people here. We ran out of show bags. There's that many people here. There's that many uh, kids on school holidays, so they're down here and uh, enjoying it and having a climb over the, the trains. The new trains boast quiet carriages, two by two seating, internet and air conditioning. It's more space than the other train. We're a little bit disappointed there's no buffet car and it's not quite up to the standard of first class on the old train. They're cool when they're new. It needs to have um, tea and coffee on board. Velocity trains the most modern and reliable services in Beeline's fleet and will operate on four of the six weekday and Saturday services to and from Bansdale. So all aboard Gippslanders come August. We have good numbers of people that do travel from Bansdale so we expect to see those numbers even increase more. Haley Pepin, Win News.